<laughs> Today's launch centres around something called Diary of a Bad Man, Think for Yourself, which is something that we've been working on um, um, for, a, for a little while now. The whole aim of it is to try to engage young people about the dangers of grooming, uh, indoctrination and radicalisation. Can you think of some recent examples of terrorist attacks? The Twin Towers, the attack in 2001? Um, in America, the, the marathon. Bruv, why are you looking at people getting their heads cut off and stuff? The key thing for us is to try and raise awareness with the young people about their responsibilities, about some of the inherent dangers that exist out there, whether it be on the internet or whether it be individuals out there with sort of negative or, or ill intentions. And the idea is to try and do it in a way that will appeal to young people. Uh, you know, using somebody like, or working with somebody like Hamza Arshad, the star of Diary of a Bad Man, who's got real credibility with young people, who's got a real pull uh, with young people. And the idea is to try and deliver a message that young people are going to try and listen to. But do you think he's going to try and go about it in the right way? Sorry. What's going on, people? You right? Did I miss anything? Can you interrupt in my session? I have an obligation as a Muslim and as a British citizen. Um, and I think that, you know, it's uh, very important for, you know, me to, as a public figure even, uh, to give back to the community. You know, the police obviously wanted my help and, you know, I just wanted to give back as well and, and try my best to use kind of my fame in a positive light. And, um, yeah, and, and, and also use comedy as a tool to get the kids' attention, but at the same time tackle, you know, uh, more important issues. Our religion is about peace. You know, and that's the whole point. And if you've got a point to prove, even if you're upset with certain issues or whatever it is, don't use anger as a tool to do what you've got to do. The kids, they all watch Diary of a Bad Man. They all watch all my shows and stuff on YouTube. And sometimes, you know, if someone says this is wrong, if you know, maybe a police officer says it to you or, 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 or a teacher or a parent or, you know, our uncle or our auntie, it might not have the same effect. But when you have someone that you actually, you know, kind of you know, look up to in the entertainment business and they say something, sometimes they, it's, you know, they get more excited and they do take it in more. So I think it's definitely going to work and I, I hope, you know, I hope that we can make a difference. These extremists, these guys who obviously haven't had a girlfriend for time, yeah, they're so angry, they got so much, you know, they, we got PS4, they got PS1, yeah, they're angry right now, so they're doing dumb stuff and they're making us look bad, so we have to counteract that and that's why I'm here today. I think Hamza's a really funny guy, but at the same time he's very, like, educational, like, you can learn a lot a lot of things from him. We enjoyed watching it, but at the same time we really learnt a lot and it was like good for us because it taught us how to like stick up for ourselves and stick to our own opinions. Um, I think it's a good idea as, as it's a serious um, subject and it's mostly for adults, but they've, but they've, brought, they've appealed it to, to um, our age. As, so as we are the future of like the community, so we know how, life, how, how to act when we grow older. Is that a recording? I think that's a recording. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty bad. No, See, that's how nervous he's making me right now. <laughs>